shows, your friend's movie, and then When Harry Met Sally. Oh, it's what was a classic. The, it is a classic. It's a great movie, but what's the memory that you associate with it, or why is it your favorite? Beyond I think it was the first romantic comedy I ever saw, um, and it's kind of started that boom of romantic comedies, you know, The Sleepless in Seattle, The You've Got Mail, The... Nora Ephron, Nora Ephron, Nora Ephron, Nora Ephron, Nora Ephron, right, and so I chose that movie because Nora Ephron was such a inspiration to me mm -hmm. um, in this character. There is a great essay she wrote, and it is in her book, I Feel Bad About My Neck, which is <laughs> such now, a fantastic, I know, yeah, yeah. I should wear a I'm scarf. I'm shooting from above, don't I worry. should wear a scarf. <laughs> and she writes in there about, it's one of her essays about her biggest flop. And I thought... Which movie is that? Um, it, it was one that ne was never made. Oh. It was a play she wrote that never, that they tried to make and it flopped, and I don't remember the name. <laughs> but she talks in that essay about how for all her success, that still haunts her, mm -hmm. that flop. The one none of us know about or care about. <laughs> and I thought more and more about how somebody with that kind of success could have had this big a flop that haunted her. And that spurred the character of, of Blake Hunter. Mm -hmm.